Okay, so like we talked about earlier, the, the uh, bongos can be like a, a, a syncopatic type of instrument or it can be an alternating beat type of instrument. So let's get a rough, rough idea of how the beats could go on the bongos. We can try the solo hits, which would be something like this. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. We can do the double beat, which would be like this. One, two, I got that reverse, hold on. One, two, one, two, one, two. Now, another one could be like a three or a four. I kind of feel myself, I get really into this, and I like to do more than the triplet. I sometimes will vary with, with a, a four beat, something like this. So what you try to do is just think in your head, think, think music, think drums, think alternating bass drum, snare drum, bass drum, snare drum. This could even be thought of as a bass drum, snare drum. So like I said, you just go one, two, 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 and it goes on and on. It gets more complicated than that. Uh, don't hesitate to try to do little rolls on the, on the bongos. It can be very exciting. And like I said, don't hesitate to pound them. I could play these all day. But let's go ahead and see if we can play along with the track again. And like I said, now that you get an idea of, of what the bongos can be like, and don't hesitate to go out to the store and pick up a set and uh, play along to some of your favorite music and with your friends.